I would like to show you some tricks in a word uh, that can be useful. Uh, for example, if you moving an object, for example, a uh, rectangle, you can move it with the mouse. And if you uh, use shift while moving, it'll be only moving in this direction or this direction. So you can orientate yourself uh, with the grid lines. If you move it with the uh, Alt key, uh, you can can move it really exactly without the uh, key. Will be uh, orientating himself with the uh, on the grid lines, and if you push Alt, it'll be exact. You can combine those two Alt and Shift, so you have exact. Uh, movement in this direction or in this direction. Yeah, you can also use the cursor keys for moving objects. Um, I can move them in this direction or this direction, and when I press um, con the control key, um, I can move them uh, really exact. Without them, it will be on the grid lines and if you use the color keys with shift um, you can ex expand the object if you combine shift with uh, the control it will be really exact and um, using the color keys with alt um, you can rotate the object and if you combine that with the control uh, key as well, it'll be really uh, small steps. When duplicating objects, you can also use some keys. Uh, I duplicate this one with the control key, like this. And when I use the control key and add shift, I can. Uh, Duplicated um, in this direction or in this direction only. When you um, when you um, duplicate it with the Alt, you can um, duplicate it on a two X in exact position without Alt. It'll be orientating himself on the, on the grid lines using Alt. It'll be really exact. And if you combine all three of them. You can move this um, along this line or this direction really exact. When you draw uh, a circle, this can be uh, helpful if you using uh, or if you drawing this ellipse, it'll be like this. If you draw it while pushing the shift button it will be always uh, a circle and now you can also add uh, or you can draw it with the with the alt key it'll be exact now without the grid lines and you combine uh, you can combine control alt and shift all three of them and um it'll be um Oh, I forgot to, to say, if you're using control, uh, you can use the middle point of a circle. Um, and if you combine all three of them, it'll be orientated on a, a middle point and can um, draw it really exact. So I'm pushing all three now and I'm starting here. If you want to change shapes, you can also use some keys. Yeah, I'm going to use shift. I have a line over here. And when I use shift, um, it'll keep the angle. And I can expand it in this direction. Uh, with control, it'll be moving uh, in both directions or expanding in both directions. And with alt, I can also be really exact. And using all three of them, 
um, all the functions will be combined. And now some other short keys or shortcuts. If you use control with uh, F1 together, you can reduce the menu. Uh, if you use uh, the scroll, uh, the mouse and scroll uh, with together with the control button pushed, you can zoom in, zoom out. You can uh, direct or navigate to uh, to the next page while using the control button and page up and page down like this. And if you have several objects, you can um you can select select them by um, using the control button. I can select this one, this one, and this one, and I can choose not to select this one while I'm pushing the um, control button. If you need some support, or you want to suggest some uh, topics for new videos, or you want to exchange some documents, I'd be glad if you join my Discord channel. The link for the uh, channel is in the video description, so I hope to see you there.